welcome back to the We Are City channel for another episode of our Manchester City career mode. We kick off today's episode with a game against Borussia Dortmund. And a win here will guarantee us top place in the group. Because, let me think about nine. Yeah, so top place in the group with a win here. We can simulate the next one. And then two days later, I believe it is, we face Newcastle. And then three days later, we face Wolves. I mean, that is big, isn't it? Really, really big. And then Arsenal at home. Two days later again. Today's episode is really about using our squad depth. It really is. So first up is Borussia Dortmund. This is Sarah going to go with Edison the starts and goes with Walker, Diaz, Guardaval and Cancelo at the back four. Roger in the holding role with Captain Gundogan and Olmo in front. Mara's on the right hand side. Parra on the left and then Haaland through the middle of the bench. Grealish, Bernardo Silva, De Bruyne, Phillips, Luis, Gomez and Ortega. Like I said, we've got this game. Three days, la three days later, we've got Newcastle. Two days later, Wolves. Two days later, Arsenal. Today's episode is about using the squad, and that is what we're going to have to do. So we're against Borussia Dortmund today in the Champions League. Three points here means we finish top of the table. We can simulate that game against Shakhtar Donetsk on match day six. We've got a rotated side out here, captain by ex-Dortmund captain Ilkay Gundogan. They come out here with a strong side. Jill Julian Brandt in there. They've got Ozkan, Hummels, Daniel Marlin, Adiemi perhaps in there as well. Emre Champ. Ismail Assar, I think, signed for them. That's a good sign. Schlotterbeck and Sealer at the back. Of course, it's a glitch on feet for the moment, which doesn't show lineups. So we've just got to go with what we see there. Mares, good recovery from Mendy, Rodri, Cole Palmer, Palmer with a hit here. What a finish from Cole Palmer. Well, has he announced himself in the Champions League there, Palmer? We said he needs to play more like a Manchester City starter. He's going to be heavily involved next season because Riyad Mahrez will look to move him on in the last year of his contract. And Palmer here, just saw the chance, then smashed it past the goalkeeper. 1-0 City, Palmer with the goal, is that his first in the Champions League this season? It's his first in only two appearances, and he'll appear, of course, in that Shakhtar game. Hold on, Palmer. Good play from Ares, Olmo. Right to Palmer. Palmer into Haaland. Haaland with a header! 2-0 Manchester City and a goal and assist for Cole Palmer. And City tear apart Dortmund just like that. So, so easy. So, so easy. Palmer on the wide area. Lovely lofty pass into Erling Haaland. Above Sula. 2-0 City. Haaland gets the goal. Palmer gets an assist. A goal and assist for him today. Within 14 minutes, we tear Dortmund apart. And she does work it wide. Chan. Oh, what a save by Edison. What a brilliant save by Edison. Is he going to get his way back in here? Is he coming back from nothing? Half time City 2, Dortmund 0. But is Edison coming back here in the most unexpected circumstances? He just might. Guardaval. What a player. What a player Guardaval's been today. Guardaval. Was it back? Mares! What a goal from City. Joshua Guardaval at centre-back is unreal. He's unreal. He replaced Laporte. And he, he just plays like a hero. Look at this. Ball through to Mahrez as well. What a finish by Mahrez. Palmer for Grealish because Palmer's injured. But what a finish by Mahrez. Guardaval's fantastic. Grealish comes on for Palmer who's injured. Rico Lewis comes on for Kyle Walker. Cancelo for Gomez. Actually, Guardaval's going to come off. Walker's going to go centre-back. Here's Phil Armendi. Behind us here, Lewis. Wouldn't quite get the win to, to get that. Brandt's chance. A little flick in, good goal by Dortmund. Bad defending by Lewis there, and then by the rest of the team, Diaz. Against Daddy Emmy, is it? Pull another one back here, Dortmund. Well, they could do because Walker's made a big mess of this one. Sebastian Alle, good save by Edison. Then he picks it up. Are we seeing an Edison comeback here? Because he's made two good saves today. But you don't just get straight back in the team. That's full time. City 3, Dortmund 1. City go through top of the group. And we can just play all the kids in that game against Shakhtar. Which is good. That's what we wanted to do. Mares, brilliant today. Guardaval, unreal at centre back. Up next, we face Newcastle at home. And this is Simon with Ortega starts single. It's going to be Cancelo, Akanji, Guardaval, Ake, the back. Four can tell at the right back position. 
Rodri gets a chance into midfield. He's played himself into that midfield. Danny Olmo doesn't start. It's going to be Bernardo Silva and Captain KDB in the midfield three. With Rodri, of course, phone on the right, Grealish on the left, and Erling Haaland through the middle of the bench called Palmer. Danny Olmo, Phillips, Gomez, Walker, Stones, and Edison. No Diaz, no Gundogan today. No Riyad Mahrez either. He's tired. The RB still not back to full sharpness. That is the side we're going to go with. I think at some point, Cantelo will go to left back and Walker will come on at right back. We should beat Newcastle. The Premier League is more important than Champions League at the moment and probably the Cup games because we're so behind, so far behind in the Premier League. You've scored 30 goals in 12 Premier League games. The fans here arriving at the Etihad Stadium, scanning in, as well as the Newcastle fans ready for a big fixture. Now, Newcastle have got Alexander Isak up top. They've got Almiron and so on on the wings. I think they've got Trippier still at the back. We'll see the team as it walks out and that will give us a better idea of the Newcastle side we face today. So how come Newcastle, Nick Polk just starting goal, it's Trippier, Botman, Sharp, Matt Target, the back for Jolinton in the midfield with Sau, I believe, and Bruno Gimaraj. Alexander Isak up top with Miguel Almiron, and I'm not sure who's on the right-hand side for Newcastle. Rodri down to the Uroina. Straight into Podens, Isak. Isak's gone here. What a ball, can't stop Alexander Isak, smashes it past Ortega, 1-0 Newcastle. Bad defending from City. One mistake and they catch us. It's a lovely finish by the Swede. One mistake and they catch us out. One mistake. One mistake. It's Bernardo Silva. Through to Haaland. Erling Haaland equalises immediately. 1-1. One, 1-1 one. One, one Manchester City. Even slid in then to put that back in the net. Well done Haaland. Good goal. Really good goal from Erling Haaland. Relation to Bernardo Silva. Into Haaland. A lovely finish into the side netting. Level already, but disappointed with the fact that we can see such a cheap goal. And onto Cancelo. Nice touch by Cancelo. Swings into De Bruyne. And to Grealish. Back to Kevin De Bruyne. 2 on Manchester City. Great play by City. Flicking it across the box. Switching it. Finding the pass. Finding the opening. And you find Kevin De Bruyne. Was Jack Grealish, and when you find De Bruyne, he does this. What a goal from De Bruyne. He's just so good. He's just so, so good. Isak counter, Newcastle. Isak's rapid. Oh my word, Alexander Isak's the best player in the world, is he? 2-2. Two -two. Just got running, I couldn't stop him. 2-2, two, -two. two goals conceded. He's just a bit quicker than a kanji. De Bruyne. Foden. Oh, down the box. He's about to score there, Phil Foden, before he gets clattered into. Oh, there's a foul the other way. Oh, there's a foul on Haaland. Trippier. Oh, Grealish, well played. Now Silva. Haaland tapping. 3-2. Back in front. This is some game, Newcastle. Definitely a test. 3-2. Pull back to Haaland. Goals galore here. Absolutely goals galore so far. Now Silva. Palmer. Okay. Into Palmer. It's a bad cross by Palmer. Come on, we need the fourth goal because Newcastle. Come on, do they have? We know they certainly can get that. The next one. Now Silva. Haaland. Chance here to get the next goal. Right at Pope. De Bruyne. Palmer. Palmer with a chance. Palmer with a winner. He's offside. Oh. I had a sense it was offside, to be honest with you. I had a sense it was offside. Come the other way. Okay. Slams him. Oh, that's so bad by the referee. De Bruyne. Palmer. Against Trippier. That's Bernardo Silva. We go back to Akanji. That is full time. A 3 2 win against Newcastle. That's massive. That's massive against a good side. They were really good. Just sort of killed the game off in the second half. Eddie Howe can't defeat Pep Guardiola this time. But believe it or not, Haaland currently isn't the top goal scorer in the Premier League. It's Jungmin Son with 12. Pamford's got 10 as well as Haaland. De Bruyne's got 9 actually. Ronaldo with 9. And top in assists, he's trying to down only seven. Phil Foden with six, Bernardo Silva with four. De Bruyne, not in there at all. So he's getting goals this season, not assists. 
Expect more goals from Haaland, don't you? Expect more goals, really, but I mean, 10 in 12, not too bad. Up next, these Wolves away from home only a few days later. The side is um, doing pretty well, stamina-wise. We're going to give KDB a rest today because he's pretty tired. So it is Ortega in goal, Stones, captain. With Guardiola at the back, with Walker and Cancelo at the full-back positions. Roger in the holding role, Bernardo Silva and Danny Almo in front. Grace on the left, Mahrez on the right, and Haaland through the middle. And eventually, we've got Foden, Diaby back from his injury. Gundogan, Phillips, Ake, Diaz and Edison. And since you won't see the Wolves side in-game, this is the side they are predicted to play. Jose Sarr starts in goal. It is Keanu Hoover, Aidu from Celta Vigo, Kilman and Ike Nuri the back four, Rabatone with Mateusz Nunes and captain Conor Roan in the midfield three, Gonzalo Goetsch through the middle with Pedro Neto on the left and Pedro Goncalves signed from Sporting Lisbon on the right-hand side. And here we go at Molyneux, Manchester City versus Wolves, a strong Wolves side, a good Wolves side. But I don't think they'll be able to stop Manchester City today. You never know. Newcastle are brilliant. Wolves are just not quite as good, despite some really good plays in there. Connor Ronan, the captain. Little nutmeg on Rodri by Ronan. Gedge. First pass stones. He's still showing here. Gedge. Is that a penalty? It is a penalty. But who's give it away? Stupid from Rodri. Gonzalo Gerge steps up. Ortega sent the wrong way. We concede first. Wolves take the lead. Up this step. Ortega the wrong way. I mean, it's a good penalty anyway. I don't think he would have saved that. City behind again. City are behind again. At least it's from set piece and not like from open play, but even so. Jose Sar long up to the fullback because he knows Cantelo's not there, but Guardavolt. Sizes it up. Grealish. Haaland. Olmo. All the way to Haaland. Haaland with a chance here. What a finish by Haaland. 1-1. One, one. Well, he's not top scorer in the league. But he think he will be by the end of the season. Unless he gets an injury. Played in brilliantly by Olmo. In behind I do. Lovely, lovely run by Haaland. Across the goalkeeper into that side net him. Level 1-1. One, one. Wolves get a, a gift from a, a penalty, don't they, from us. Counter for Wolves. Guardiola's got some running to do. Keanu Hoover. Crossing. Stones. 2 on Wolves. John Stones has got to read that. John Stones has got to read that. Cross comes in here. He's got to read that, Stones, hasn't he? 2 on. Wolves back in from. Ronan. Pass Cancelo. And Ronan's still going. Pulls it back. What a save, Ortega. He says Edison's not starting. Grealish. Rodri. Ronald Silva. Mares. Rodri. Out to Cancelo. Haaland. Bernardo Silva. 2 2. This is for Haaland. Bernardo scores. 2 2. No need to celebrate it, Bernardo. We shouldn't be conceding all these goals. Nice finish from Bernardo on his right foot. Level. I think the side are disappointed, they are. Ronan runs away. Ronan. Stones just floors him. Jan Hoover. Stones a big challenge. It's a foul by John Stones. He's not having a good game at centre-back, Stones, I have to say. Not having a good game today. Hoover's fine. Whoa, red carpet. What? The referee sends John Stones off for that. No, Silver. We've got Haaland. We should be okay. And he's gone in Haaland away from I do. Haaland's going to score. 3-2. It's 3-2, but I can't believe Stone's been sent off there. Completely crushed our way of playing. 3-2, Manchester City. Another goal for Haaland. He's taken the captain's armband, by the way. Played him by Bernardo. Just his pace and his, his power. He's unbelievable to stop. Wonderful finish from Haaland. He's now scored 12 in 13 games. Well, he's catching up to his record. Jack Rillish comes off. 
for Diaz. Grealish looks happy to come off there. He didn't look like he was disappointed to be taken off. Or the one to be taken off. Cross in here. Got a hole in there. Giving away to Rodri. Olmo. Bernardo Silva. Mahrez! Oh, that is his technique, isn't it? That is signature Mahrez. Couldn't pull it off. Bernardo with a swing into the far post. Diaz misses it. Completely. Rodri. Ruben Diaz. Oh, Haaland in there. Diaz down the box, referee. That's a penalty. Ball from Bernardo. Don't throw away three points here. We're about to. We're about to score Wolves 3-3. Three, three. Could see it. Could see it. The RB for Mares. Come on, City. We're conceding goals for fun here. We're in again here. 4 3. Get Ruben Diaz off that field. 4 3. Just flicked a switch, did Wolves, it felt. Harlan turn. Oh, what they done with the defence there? It won't let me pass it to Bernardo Silva, clearly. Harland. Bernardo Silva! Th level. 4 4. No De Bruyne today, but Bernardo has definitely filled in for him, hasn't he? 4 4. It won't let me go to Bernardo first time, which is interesting. City 4, Wolves 4. In the 80th minute, can we go and win this with 10 men? The Wolves are just so open, it's unbelievable. Haaland across, sir. Bernardo. Diaby! Why the post by Diaby? Foden. Diaby. Through to Haaland. Haaland with a chance here. Straight at Sar again by Haaland. Bernardo to the far post. Man, he thought he was the hero for Wolves. Away there. Diaby. Cancelo. The Arby. Joshua Guardaval misses. Right into the Wolves player. Three on two now, Wolves. He's offside, surely. Campania. Oh, Walker. How can Kyle Walker not foul him there? 5 4 Wolves. Kyle Walker, you clown. How's Walker not foul him there? How's Walker not took him down and got the red card there? We can't even get that right. We can't even get a foul right. What is that from Walker? Jose Sa makes that save, doesn't he? Foul into the RV. Come on. Maybe we can equalise. We're not going to go and win this game now. The RV, great skill. Near post to Haaland. Tries to nod it on. Won back by Wolves. Cleared away by Wolves. Full time. Wolves 5, City 4. Defence is terrible. We can score four goals as much as we want. But we cannot defend. Gonzalo Guedes for the hat-trick. John Stones the red card. Just continues to get worse. While well, youth team currently have some real, real top quality players. One of those is Marcus Townsend. 92 to 94 potential. 66 rated. Welcome to the Manchester City first team. And the same goes for Mateo Ramirez. He is 70 rated now, the Spaniard. Attacking midfielder, central midfielder. Looks really, really good. Again, 93 to 94 potential. He is a potential superstar. He's going to be a superstar. And now we go into our final game of the episode after that absolutely terrible result in the last fixture. I just don't know what's going on at the moment. I'll take a start. It's going to be Cancelo, Akanji, Guadal and Nathan Ake, the back four. Rodri in the holding role with Kevin De Bruyne, the captain, and Ilkay Gundogan in the midfield three. We'll give Gundogan the captaincy. He's downgraded or decreased to 83 now, Ilkay Gundogan. We've got Grealish on the left, Diaby on the right, and Phil Foden with the false nine role again. A few times in today's episode, we've had to do that. Erling Haaland is very tired, so that's why he's going to come out as an impact sub, hopefully. We've got Danny Olmo, Bernardo Silva, Phillips, Diaz, Walker, and Edison on the bench. No, Gomez, Stones is obviously injured, um, or suspended, sorry. Alvarez still injured. That's a big, that's a massive miss to the, to the moment for our squad. We literally have no other strikers. Maris is not in there today, neither is Cole Palmer. 
and we face Arsenal. Well, just too many games in too little amount of time at the moment, and we're struggling with the squad anyway. I mean, we only have one injury actually in Joao Cancelo, but the performances aren't happening. The players aren't performing for whatever to the level we expect. I'd like to see at the end of this episode where we are in the Premier League table. That will give us some idea of how poorly we're performing throughout the season. Mikel Arteta is the test today with Arsenal. On Arsenal side with Rob Holding, Matt Turner, Elo Stondo, I believe. Tommy Asu, Zinchenko returns to the City. Gabriel Jesus, I know, is up top. Marquinhos is on the wing. Laconga, Partey in the midfield as well. Martinelli, Martin Odegaard. The main man there in the end, Gabriel Jesus. To Di Bruyne. Rob Cancelo. Di Bruyne. The RB on his left foot, say, by Matt Turner. Good chance, though. Tommy Asu away from Gundogan. Falling behind to Lukonga. To Gabriel Jesus. Kanji there. Chance! Oh, it's a finish by Martinelli. I'd have to say he's poor by Ortega. I'd have to say he's poor by Ortega. Well, what is the keeper doing there, Ortega? That's Edison level of goalkeeping. Martinelli's first of the season. 1 0 down to Arsenal. Pep Guardiola, perhaps. Under pressure here at City. Who's the Arby? De Bruyne! Why the post? Well, we have so many chances. Arsenal have had one. And they've scored it with Martinelli. Holding a Kanji into Musa Di Arby. Counter City here. And there's actually plenty of options here. Bowden. Through to Di Arby. Against Sinchenko. Great skill. Di Arby. And as he goes to give it to Di Bruyne. He's tackled. That is hard time on the Arsenal. Well, we're slipping down the table, aren't we? Seems like every team in the Premier League is inconsistent at the moment. Not just us, but maybe it's the competitive of the Premier League. The other teams are better. I'm not quite sure. Poor at the moment, though. We're missing so many chances. Okay, out of position. Marquinhos. Maraval can't stop it. Odegaard into Martinelli. Into Gabriel Jesus. It's 2-0 Arsenal. And that is probably game. That is probably game. That's probably game, isn't it? 2-0 to Arsenal. We don't look like scoring. They've had two chances and scored them both. Bowden. Grealish. Gundogan in there. Cleared away by Arsenal. Roger wins there to De Bruyne. To Diaby. Moussa Diaby. Foden the rebound. Tommy Asu away. And that just sums up our day at the moment, doesn't it? The Phil Foden doesn't score that one. Grealish down to Nathan Ake. De Bruyne. Diaby. De Bruyne, again, Arsenal, I mean, I wish I could defend like these guys do. So much better than us. Get the foot in, make the challenges, don't they? Keep compact. Back into De Bruyne. Fold him. Fold him, finds Grealish. De Bruyne. Into Gundogan, folding in there again, Arsenal, heroic, brilliant defending, and Phil Fones picks up an injury. And a foul by Rodri, on Martin Odegaard. Frustration challenge from the Spaniard. This could be a red colour card, and it's not, it's a yellow one. Gundogan. Haaland the chance here, 2 1, 72nd minute. Good ball by Gundogan, good finish by Haaland. Let's go. Let's go, City. Too many defeats this season. I think we're on about five defeats nearly, which we can't win a Premier League with five defeats, I don't feel. Tommy Asu. Draw, draws are not so helpful either. Gundogan. Haaland. Into Kevin De Bruyne. De Bruyne smashes one in 2-2. Two, two. Well, as soon as Haaland comes on, he changed the game for Manchester City. The goal and assist. Almo for Gundogan. Lovely finish by De Bruyne. I could have gone back to Haaland, possibly. That's a wonderful finish by De Bruyne, however. 2-2. Two, two. can stand here, Rodri. So slow. What about? My God! My God, the defending is so bad. Jesus scores. That's Rodri, that, because he can't even be bothered to play football. 3 2 down, Rodri comes on. We get back into it and then throw it away again. Into Musa Diaby. Diaby! Oh, Save by Turner. Probably should score. 
Cross into Haaland off the line. Haaland on the rebound off the line again. Olmo down Ake. Guardiola. Olmo. Olmo into the Arby. Across to Kevin De Bruyne. 3-3. Three, three. He's picked up an injury, De Bruyne. 3-3 three, three in the 88th minute. No, you celebrate like you've just won the league. De Bruyne is injured as well. Foden and De Bruyne picking up injuries here. We've got no one else off the bench, have we? Walker's going to come out. We're out of subs as well. We've made our five subs, so. Back wide to Olmo. Into Haaland. Haaland with the right foot, good save by Turner. 30 seconds remain for Manchester City here to get three points. Do not waste this corner. De Bruyne are in. On to Bernardo Silva, all people. De Bruyne's on. Cross in. Nathan Ake! What a save by Matt Turner. What a save. De Bruyne are in. Bernardo Silva again. Header. Haaland's in there. Arsenal away. Full time is 3 3. City again. Drop points. Two points. Should have won that game. Should have won that game and didn't do. What a save by Matt Turner at the end. Maybe we have to go back to basics. Maybe we have to change this. I'm not quite sure. We'll have a look at the Premier League table before we end the episode. Well, bad news for Phil Foden. Three months out with a broken tailbone injury. And this is how the Premier League table is looking. We are six points off league leaders Spurs. Two points off second place Newcastle. You can see there we've got nine wins, three draws and three losses. Spurs so far, no draws then, but three losses as well. Three losses enough. We can't really afford to be losing any more. We've scored more goals than anyone else, but we've conceded. I mean, look at that. 26 goals conceded. Defence is a massive issue, and we might have to try and go back to basics. Thank you very much for watching. Please do like the video if you haven't already. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, and we'll see you guys next time.